When should you start? When's the best time to start a, an accelerated self-healing program? Well, some people will agonize with this kind of question. When should, well, oh, I have the flu right now, so this is not a good time. Oh, I'm, you know, we, we can come up with any reason not to start, but actually there is no reason not to start at any given time. What we see in the biocommunication is a snapshot in time. It's what's happening in real time right at that moment. And so it's going to support you starting where you're at and, you know, go through that first month program, whether you have the flu or you don't have the flu. It's, it's not uh, important to the question of when to start. You start when, when you can. If you're able to start now, you know, if you have symptoms, you don't, don't have symptoms, that's just where you're at. You might have symptoms that are intermittent. We can test when you have symptoms, we can test when you don't have symptoms. Uh, in the testing process, when there are symptoms, sometimes the symptoms are relieved even during the test, even with a remote test. I've had plenty of times when, when we find out later on, we're not actually on the phone or on the internet usually with you while we're testing. We're testing remotely, and then we get together with the information that we've gathered, and we go through and, and explain and, and talk, to you, talk you through the results, what we're seeing. Uh, but uh, we find out after the fact, many times, oh, gee, when we were testing here, the, the, the child we were testing, for, for them on the East Coast, it was the middle of the night, but that's the exact time when his fever broke, you know? So the, the biocommunication process is actually a healing process. It's not just diagnostic, and it's not like many diagnostic processes that are actually detrimental, like, you know, uh, uh, doing a mammogram. You know, for years we've, we've suggested that's not a good idea. Well, now the conventional system has enough data to say, it's not a good idea. We're causing the thing we're looking for. If we look enough, we'll find it. That's not good for you. That's, you know, that's, has economic reasons for existing, not health reasons for existing.